verse 8. It's a long read, but I'll just keep, go to one point. He said, These be the names of the mighty men whom David had. The Tak, the Tak Monite, that sat in the sea, chief among the captains. The same was Adino the Esnite. He lifted up his spear against 800 whom he slew at one time. Verse 9. And after him was Eleazar, the son of Dodo, the Ahohite, one of the three mighty men with David, when they defied the Philistines that were gathered together to battle. And the men of Israel were what? Say, why some were fighting? Why some are laboring? Some ran away. That's not even the point. Go to the stair. This word caught me. Over 30 years ago, I heard this for the first time. He arose and smote the Philistines until his hand was weary and his hand clave unto the soul. And the Lord did what? Wrought a great victory that day. Can you read the last bit with me? What did he say? And the people returned after him only to come and enjoy the benefit of the war. But he said, I will never forget. He said, there are some of you looking at me just as I'm pointing at you. When work is called, God notices when you escape, he writes it down. When it's time to celebrate, God also notices when you walk in to come and enjoy the spoils of the labor of other people. He said, God writes it down. Can you see the details to which God weighs our attitude and our actions? The Bible says when it was time for the war and the men, the previous war, ran away. And the Bible says when the victory was won and the celebration, he said, and the people returned and he uses the word only to come and enjoy the spoil. I feel like asking you this morning, how do you relate with God? Do you relate with God like a supermarket that you go to only when you have a need? Or you relate with God when it is time to identify with God. I need you to know, please listen to me. I'm speaking to you clearly. God marks it down. He notes it down. The reason the Bible says the scriptures are written is that it's written for our example. Everything written. God is so detailed in measuring our devotion that when we run away from work, he writes it down. When we return only to collect, only to enjoy, only to eat, only to grab, I need you to know the God you serve records it down. Just puts your name there. He has just returned because it's time to celebrate. Time to walk. Yes, write it down. He has just escaped again. He doesn't want to be a part of who's walking. 